Here with us today is Trooper Nicholas Cederberg from Oregon State Police. As President Donald Trump prepared to award OSP Trooper Nick Cederberg the Medal of Valor, he offered his outward assessment. He looks awfully good. Twelve bullets. It looks good if he took no bullets, you know? Some pretty good doctors, I guess, right? Great job. The White House ceremony was far removed from Christmas night in King City, 2016. So somebody watch my left side up here. Gotcha, gotcha. That night, Trooper Cederberg responded to the call asking all area law enforcement to find a white Mitsubishi driven by James Tilka. Tilka had just murdered his wife and was now speeding through Washington County. Nick raced to find him and soon located the murderer and chased him into a dead end road. The suspect made a U-turn, rammed right into Nick's car, and then immediately opened fire. Tilka shot Cedarberg 12 times at close range. Cedarberg returned fire, and as backup responded, Tilka shot himself in the head. Cedarberg would spend the next 48 days in the hospital. After a very tough recovery, Nick survived, and Trooper Cedarberg, we are very honored to have you with us in the White House. Thank you very much. Great day. The Medal of Valor is the nation's highest and most prestigious award for public safety officers. Only a dozen or so receive it each year. When the president placed the medal around Cedarberg's neck, he secured his place in our nation's history. Every one of today's Medal of Valor recipients confronted life and death situations. The president also addressed their family, saying, you carry a great burden so that our citizens can live in safety and peace. Laurel.